Thanks for helping me, Regabi. I really appreciate it. I don't know what I would have done. Why, of course, then, Swanee. What kind of a big, strong engine would I be if I didn't help the elderly? It wouldn't be dignified. Oh, you cheeky rapscallion. Just you wait till I'm properly on my wheels. I'll show you one for. I have no doubt you will, 1020, my friend. Say, do you reckon you know what time it is? I think Adam is running a bit late. I stand corrected. Well, hello, Adam. What time do you call this? I swore you could have gotten stuck in a ditch somewhere. Sorry, Mr. Hotshot. There was a cow stuck on the line, and we had to wait for it to be moved. But my driver quickly shooted away, so it didn't cause much of a problem. Oh, hey, Adam. I see you're pulling the train I used to pull so many years ago. Ah, good times. Oh boy, how the time has flown by, though. It hasn't been so kind to me. Nonsense, 1020. You look fresh as a daisy. And besides, you're holding up way better than some engines, I could say. By the time the Wells with Fincettery engines hit your age, well, they were all fit for scrap. Now that you mention it, who used to run your line, Adam? Yeah, I remember Eagle mentioned them a few days ago, but I never got a clear answer on who they are. Hmm, who used to run your line? Hmm... I'm so sorry, 1020. What is it? I kind of zoned out a bit. Are you okay, Adam? We kind of lost you there for a second. Yes, I'm completely fine, 1020. Don't worry about me. Ooh, and there's my god. I better go. See you two later. Ciao! Should we tell him he left with no guard's whistle? I think he'll figure it out himself. Let's just tell him at a later time.